Good morning everyone. So we have spent the last oh, week and a half with um, a bunch of different viruses going around, none of COVID. Um, the kids currently have a wicked one with high temps, um, pretty much all COVID symptoms, but out of the 50 or 60 tests I've done on them over the last couple of days, not one has turned positive and apparently it's just a separate virus that is going around. Um, so they get like um, a sore stomach, um, a headache and a sore throat. Lachlan has a cough today so I'm going to um, test him again because he wasn't sick originally. He's one of the newer ones and his best friend has COVID who we spend a lot of time with. Um, so I am going to test him and I'm starting to feel sick today so We'll see how this goes. Um, I've so far missed all these illnesses. We've had several different ones. We had a really a chesty cough one go through. Stephen came back from camp two weeks ago with a nasty, we reckon he had the flu, but you can't get into a doctor, so who knows? And they won't test you anyway, but he was really crook. Um, he could hardly walk upstairs to have a shower. Um, so yes, so it's been a rather eventful few weeks. Um, and I have slowly been sorting through. I'm um, sorting through really slowly, partly because Gracie da takes up quite a bit of my time. Six children do too. Um, but I want to go through every single drawer and every single box, everything, everything um, properly. Usually I'll sort of hide it. Um, like when I do a room, I'll sort of move it to a different room. But no, um, I want to do it properly, which is taking forever. Um, but yeah, we have gotten rid of quite a bit of stuff that has gone to um, the salvos or savers, savers we take it to, um, and that sort of thing. So it is slowly getting there. I also have a whole bunch of stuff I want to sell because um, it's like a little bit more expensive that, to send it to um, the op shop. So yes, I've got a pile of that, which is just around the corner, and there's a whole heap of stuff in the garage that I want to get rid of, a whole heap of toys, like I've grouped them up to make toy bundles and stuff. Very tedious work it's been, um, but our house still looks like a schmozzle because I'm literally going through everything. Um, and yes, and kids have been going to um, doctor's appointments. We've just, and we've started doing sports again. Um, I forgot how draining this part was uh, and that, I am looking at going back to work, but I'm going to see how we go um, and do that. I think I'm going to go back to work and do just a couple of shifts a week uh, just to help out and to get my mind off the house because, yes, I need some sort of stimulation. Um, and yes, so yeah, so that is our plan for the moment. It's so dark in here. It's, we're going through like a massive cold snap. Um, Oh, an arctic blast so um that's fun um yes so i have a whole heap of stuff to do i want to move oh we're still room moving too during this process which has been rather draining we've changed where everyone's going about 50 times i swear um so i'll start moving them there and then we'll be like no 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 we won't do that because that is annoying um all those kids are annoying together but um i think we've changed it from when I told you in the last vlog. So where Bella and Harry and Joel were, we're now putting um, Olivia, Zoe and Nora instead of Harry and Joel. Harry and Joel will stay upstairs, but into the other room, the bigger room. Um, and then the three older boys are going in the front. Caitlin will come upstairs and Stephen will stay in his room that Andrew was in. Um, Yes, so that is the plan today, but um, that one I think will work the best. We found it, um, Bella and, well it was, we haven't ever put Harry and Joel in there, but Bella squeals at them when they walk into a room, so, um, and she was getting rather annoying, telling everyone she had her own room, and I'm not annoying, but, um, you know, bragging about it. So we're putting the girls in there, we're going to keep it the setup as it is, because we find it works. Um, Bella is older than the other girls, so she's turning nine in a few weeks. I think she's turning nine. Yeah, she's turning nine. Um, 
got um, and the other girls are only five four and one so we're going to keep that separation to them we're going to put the other girls on the other side Gracie will stay in here so we'll move her cot over here um, and yeah that's pretty much an update on our whole life and I need to get on with my day and start sorting we have this that we got for the uniforms I don't want to go down lower because but um I originally wanted a two one so I can do the school shirts at the top and then anything I hang for the wardrobes down the bottom because I currently just lay them on the floor and then people trudge over them um because sometimes I do it gradually and anyway um don't have time to actually put them in the wardrobes because they're asleep because I do it at night so hopefully that stops that that will go into Caitlin's new room I think because she owns tons of clothes as we found out and yes so I have to go and do other stuff now <laughs> so here is my list of things to do today I've already done the top one and I've done load one it just beeped before of washing I haven't folded making lunch and bottles is later and I'm filming a vlog so there we go I've been putting massive lists down and I never get through any of it, so starting small today, seeing if that helps. Hello beautiful. You look horrible. You feeling better? No? What are you doing? Sliding? Good morning, beautiful girls. Hi. You are so cute. Hey, baby. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Look at those smiles. Good morning everyone. Today is actually Stephen's birthday. He has asked that we don't film his birthday today, which we're totally fine with. Um, but I thought I'd film getting his party ready. I've actually, it's almost lunchtime. I have a whole bunch of kids home. We've had the flu, so we've been off. I'm, um, I haven't got it the worst. Harry has it the worst, I reckon. Stephen had it pretty bad. And so did Lachlan and um, Olivia. The other one's sort of got it like me. But um, within a couple of days, seem to be better. I might be running on adrenaline, so we'll see how I am tomorrow because it's only day two for me. But um, we are doing a Mexican fiesta. He did ask for a Hawaiian party, but when we more looked into it, it felt very girly. Anyway, he loves Mexican, so we thought we would do that. He loves food more than Mexican. Um, so I'm gonna make a whole like taco bar and whatever and um, um so i've got chicken fajitas on um and the slow cooker i've been collecting dishes from um like the op shop and stuff like mexican looking dishes or at least colors so i got a whole heap of these dishes um and this Ooh, one it is yeah um i got him a sombrero and then we got some maracas i was actually supposed to pick up more but um, you can drink from these. We can. Um, and then I got these are the first ones I got, but I got this one. This is actually a really nice what bowl. Are these? What are um, these? That red platter over there, that tablecloth um, is from Royal Dalton. I just looked up the price of it, and its resale price is really high. So maybe I'll just sell it because I brought it for $3. Yeah. But um, I actually do are like it. But in here? Yeah, they're the other stuff. So we got another like taco um, and I can put salsa. I'll put the taco chips around it and some salsa. Um, I'm not making his cake because I was sick. I didn't want to make it. And he actually admitted that he actually wanted one from the cake store. So I went and grabbed one, not from where we usually get it. Because I had to go to the shop really quickly this morning. 
and I just grabbed one from the bakery but um, I need to go back because the bakery seemed really nice I've never really walked in there it's always really busy and I'm always in a rush so anyway I grabbed two cakes from them because they were kind of on the smaller side um, one was similar to what I was making but a little girly but um, yes um, are they good plates? Yeah. Do you think Stephen will like his party? Yeah. Look what I got. I got cactuses to put up in our house. Mm -hmm. Oh, cactuses. That will hurt. And then I got this thing. I don't even know what this is. It's a uh, scene setter. These uh, are really uh, things that uh, Eric uh, usually puts uh, up. But. It is. And then we have a taco wagon. It's a balloon. Oh, it's a balloon? Yeah. I don't it's, think it's a balloon. It's a I think it's just balloon. a backdrop that you can take photos in front of. So we'll see where we can put it. Um, and then I, just, I literally had to go to the store really fast and get all this stuff. Because we've been so busy lately. Some cutouts. I think I went a little crazy on his. I struggled to get Pokemon stuff. And then there was so much Mexican. What is that? That's like a banner. Banner? But I really don't think I need half this stuff. And then I got some maracas. Anyway, and I got these cups because I was going to go down to the um, USA Foods and grab some drinks. And I'm just realized I actually don't need to have a soft drink. Um, um, but I found these cups and I'm like, I'll just buy cheap soft drink. Just be careful with them. Um, and we'll just use them. But I need to set this up. It's already lunchtime. Eric's picking them up. He's actually leaving work early because he gets... Um, hours over a certain time for family time or um, time um, that yeah anyway time where he can like take it to the dentist or go to the dentist himself and anyway so he's taking that chunk off tonight to do the party um, and yes so we're gonna get this done and then I've got another one in like three weeks no four weeks for Bella so we're in party season because yeah. and then we have olivia and then harry like only two days later and yeah then just keeps rolling joel and um cooper are in september and then eric caitlin and andrew are in october zoe and um lachlan are in november so and then we have christmas so uh yes this is our ball time of year so yes, I need to get this going. All right, so I've got these dangly things in the door. Set up his little outfit that I brought him. This thing, that's a pain to make. Then I've got the cute little cups out. Now I need to do the um, beef strips. I need to, I just buy rump and I cut it up myself. And then I need to cook them up with some more capsicum. Um, I've got the chicken one in here already. And then we just got some um, tortillas and I might make nachos. Um, was my plan, but we'll see how we go. All right, so I've got this to make nachos. I don't want to do it now because I think <coughs> nachos would go cold really quickly. This salad, the um, like actual taco shell things, and then just a few little sides. Lettuce, because not many of the kids have lettuce. Chipotle topping, some cups, salsa for the um, chips, and then this is for the mince and the what? chicken wraps. And then we have his presents, and I pop this down because I didn't want it to get dirty. Here, and all over here, this is a complete mess. We've got the mince, and then the slow cooked chicken, and then I have the beef, the beef. And the thing I'm in there, which I'm probably going to turn off now, otherwise it's going to dry it out. And some more capsicum. So that should be it for all the prep. Um, Eric has the guacamole sauce and some soft drink because I put the guacamole sauce and the sour cream in our wardrobe accidentally with the presents. So oops. Um, so they had to be thrown out. Obviously, they've been in there for a few days. So yes, but that is it.